Hey y'all, it's Ricky T and I'm coming to you from my dining room here at the Taylor Plantation. It's a beautiful evening at the end of August. We're getting ready to hit uh, September. So let me tell you what's going on here. So, Hannah's boyfriend, Hunter, is taking a beer appreciation class at IUPUI. So he has to go pick up this pre-packed box of various beers. There's like 16, 17 beers in here. And in the class, you have to taste every one of them. They teach you all kinds of stuff, like, you know, how to how to pick up flavor notes, mouth, feel, all that stuff, right? And so there's one of every different kind of beer. So I tell Hunter, I say, hey man, when you go pick up your box of beer, buy two of them. I'll pay you for the other. Let's do this together. I figured it'd be a fun bonding kind of thing to do, you know, have a little fun with it, compare notes, etc. So there's all kinds of beers. I'll be honest with you, I only saw three beers in the pack that I've ever had before. So there's a lot of, I'm gonna be trying a lot of new stuff. So we start with the first one, which is what we're gonna review today. And this one is one of the ones I've had before. If I've had it once, I've had it a thousand times. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the Miller Lite. Now, if they're gonna pick an American light lager, I'm glad they picked Miller Lite because uh, I don't really like the other. Bud Light is Clydesdale's piss. I hate it. And Coors Light sucks too. Miller, I can do Miller Lite. I will say I am a fan of Yingling brewery. Uh, brewery. Um, I like Yingling Light and I like Yingling Flight. I do like both of those actually better than Miller Lite. So, since I've been talking, the head is gone. Here's the glass I got it in. Now, there's probably a couple of people who I know who will watch this video and they'll say, I remember those glasses. That's from back in the day. Um, these are Michelob glasses and I'm drinking Miller Lite in it. So anyway, this is a light lager. Probably not going to be much to it. Matter of fact, there's not going to be much to it. We've all had Miller Lite. We know what it is. But I'm going to, whatever, he, he does two beers a week in the class. So whatever two beers he has, that's what I'll do. So y'all are going to be getting quite a few uh, beer reviews from me. All right, so here we go. Let's do it. Anytime you do a tasting, you start with the aroma. Then you take a sip. You swirl it around. You know, the whole thing. So you're going to be seeing me do it, right? So here we go. Here we go. On the nose, almost nothing. Almost nothing. I do get, I do get like a, I can get a cereal grain, like a light, very light cereal grain. Very light cereal grain. That's it. It's a light beer. It's basically beer flavored water. I like Miller Lite because you get it really cold. It's refreshing. It's light. In the mouth, um, very thin. Um, that's about all I can say about that. Um, Flavor-wise, let's taste again. Miller Lite has never been a beer that I have thought about just stopping and just taking my time to like pick up the flavor notes. And guess what? There really aren't any. <laughs> there really aren't any flavor notes. It's, it's just like, it's beer water. But I like it. It's At least it doesn't have a repugnant flavor like Bud Light does. And, and um, Coors Light has this weird, nasty flavor to it. This is very refreshing, very cold, but there's not much flavor. I mean, it's, it's super smooth because it is super light. It's thin as water. Um, tiny little, tiny little something on the back end that's kind of hits you then goes away. But Miller Lite is what it is. This is something you drink. Oh, excuse me. This is something you drink on a hot summer day and you're pounding them, okay? It's very cold, it's very refreshing. What little taste there is, it's good. There's nothing repugnant. There's nothing 
bad about the taste, no aftertaste, no bitterness. It's just a very nice, cold, light, thin, watery beer to drink on a hot day. And I like it. And you know, if you're gonna have a light beer, I would suggest this one. Most of you have probably had it. So that's it. Again, very thin, water thin, not much flavor, but cold and delicious. Uh, so that's it. That's Bud Light. I mean, I, there's nothing else to say. It's Bud Light. All right, I mean, it's Miller Light. That's all you can say. It's Miller Light. I mean, got my daughter here. She's getting ready to open her big mouth. So that's all we got. So until next time. God bless America. There you go.